was. Well, you know, John really put himself out there, and he um, he enjoyed media, but um, I, I did a, I, I, I did so much work on like watching him, and you hear so many different stories about who he was, from the people who knew him, from the way he presented himself, and people who he did business with, and um, and I feel like it gave me a lot of freedom to in this you know in this uh, home in Palma Valley kind of take the mask off and have a good time with playing who he is with his family and with this with this man he's discovering a good friend in, you know. But I think he is eccentric and that's that's uh, I think part of the magic about him, you know. Look, isn't it extraordinary what he did? Let's start out. <laughs> uh, I mean he is twelve years old. <laughs> I mean, uh, we all, he walked onto that set the very first day with his wig and his gait and his clothes and his demeanor and all of us just went, wow, this guy is it and we felt a tingle up our spine and I hope you did too. Well, there, there, was almost a, there was almost a chin there for a while too. <laughs> we had this worked hard, really hard trying to make a fake chin work. <laughs> we, 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 we employed these rather inept people make a chin and it didn't work and, 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 and then we abandoned it and, and, and he became the part uh, without the chin which I think he did rather well. <laughs>